forecast. It changes all the time.
got a story. I got a story to tell you. Oh, I was saving it for this trip. Derek told me not to tell her, say anything. So, oh well, she never told me. <laughs> she told me, man. Um, okay. Derek Spreadle. <laughs> well, he, uh, him and his friend went down to Kmart on, I believe, Pat and Andy. And, see, and went and sewed some uh, spray paint, you know, the stuff you shake in the can. Well, the thing is, the, the, the thing is, well, he didn't steal it. They was waiting at the door. Yeah. <laughs> I caught it. He was on, he was on, he was on camera. And he was waiting right at the door, and uh, they got him. And uh, uh, I don't think he got to the door, so they got him. And uh, they, uh, they, the cops came and took him out in handcuffs. <laughs> man, you shouldn't tell me that, man. I'm, I'm putting the blog, <laughs> the Cowboys blog. <laughs> and then he was at County G, you know, the County Jail. <laughs> I saw his mugshot. <laughs> Man, um, and stuff, and uh, I tell you, uh, uh, you, you need to not, not, uh, it was not all his brother's fault. It was that friend of his talk, was talking to me and doing that. That's what Derek told me. So that's not a good friend. That's not a good friend, people. That's not a good friend. They talk you into shoplifting. That's not good. Cause he was up in Duncan County Jail and he said he saw some, some interesting people. Very interesting people, you know? <laughs> some people's on drugs and all that good stuff. <laughs> so Derek, I'm sorry man, you should never tell me, man. You should never tell me. You know, like I said in the last trip to Carowinds, I talked to my been jugging nuggets and I'm talking about your brother. <laughs> I can't, I won't mention his name, so I'll say it's Derek Sprott, <laughs> so I'm gonna say, I'm gonna keep that, keep his daddy quiet, you know, keep his daddy, you know, his name, I'm not gonna say it, you know, I'm not, you know, so, uh, so yeah, that's what happened, man, uh, uh, you know, Derek should never tell me, man, he should never tell me, so, you know, that's not a good idea, is it, Wally? Yeah. How many shop over you see at Walmart? I don't know, we catch them every day. Yeah. <laughs> uh, my friend Robin, she was, uh, she's, she's been there almost a month. Well, yeah, I'll call for her. She was telling me I need to make these videos on the way to kill one short. She said, she, she said, I don't need to make another 45 minute video. <laughs> she said 35, she said, she said 30 would be the max. So I said, I can try to do 35. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so uh, yeah, Derek. I'm sorry, man. I had to do it, you know. So let's get on the, about the jugging nuggets, man. Uh, remember, I was telling you I thought it was kind of fake. You know about him uh, getting locked in that room for like 40, uh, 40, about 45 minutes. Um, yeah, it was fake. He came out and um, killed his dad. <laughs> he killed his dad. I watched the finale of the Psycho series. <laughs> he shot his dad and he killed him and, and escaped and escaped to uh, Switzerland. <laughs> my cousin said, "My cousin said we, United States has rights to go over to Switzerland, and so that's not good to escape to them in that country because we have rights to go to that country." <laughs> you know. <laughs> So, yeah, he, uh, it was interesting, uh, he, uh, escaped, saw him get on, on, on a plane and stuff in general, it was interesting. Then he, uh, got to the top of the mountain, Switzerland, and, uh, he, uh, was going about, to, he's about to hunt himself. <laughs> so, uh, and things, uh, stuff so uh, that was interesting uh, so then 
then it was final. It was. I know it was fake. When when he um, when he said the, his last things that he didn't want nobody subscribing to him and blah blah this. Then he then he he said rap. He said this is a rap. And he drew down the camera and he saw his family in the background. Uncle Larry didn't get old. That was all. It was all acting. You know I. You know, I was showing you, he was in that my closet having a meltdown. Remember, he was trying to call people? <laughs> it was all acting. So, now he's making real blogs. Yep, he's making real blogs. Uh, he said something about us, a new series next year. He can't do it now. So. He's, going, he's trying to get behind this. He's going, he's got a bunch of behind the scenes of the Psycho series. His dad's not that kind of force in real life. It was all act. I hope not. I don't want a parent like that. You know, breaking stuff all the time, you know? So, people, don't say, it's not bad stuff. It was all, it was all, a, a, all a reality soap opera show. <laughs> yeah, he cut his hair, shaved, yeah. He looks. He done that. To, he he had to had to, to look like that because he, he had look uh, poor, you know, long hair, shave, you know. I mean. <laughs> I know his family likes to go uh, go uh, go on vacation North Carolina, you know, down the coast. Yeah, I don't know if people likes to likes to go down the, the coast and stuff. Yeah, he's down in, down there a while back. He was filming so. Yeah, that was something. Ah. Yeah, I asked Derek. I said, Derek, what you what your parents do about the about your photo? Getting going to jail and stuff. He said he, his parents he didn't do nothing. I, if, it was, if it was my kid, I'd be, I'd be on his back saying you shouldn't be hanging out with them kind of people, you know. So that's beside the point. So hope you're enjoying this vlog. Uh, hope I'm not making too long, Robin. <laughs> since 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 I'm you know thinking about you. <laughs> Up, uh, you walking working yesterday?
buddy at uh, BNB Pharmacy, he thinks I'm very interesting. That's what my cousin was saying about these blogs I've, I've made. <laughs> I said, you want to see a different side, you know, of the all lives metal and uh, why I don't care about talking anymore, <laughs> people. <laughs> You'll see a different side of me. <laughs> oh, well, you know. <laughs> Guess I'm just a bad influence on everybody. <laughs> so that's my opinion. Everybody has the right to freedom of speech. And everybody has the right to disagree with people. <laughs> so we live in a free country. That's what I hopefully we're living in. Um, yeah, I must have. Uh, I won't get payback on this another epic kill intro. I hope you like this, Tommy. <laughs> on the way to Kelwin's, doing the bridge again. <laughs> they keep on working on this, don't they? <laughs> when are they gonna get done? I think they're gonna get, get done Wally. Uh, it don't look like it. No. For years. So. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Oh. Well, you're back. Uh, what would you say the, the estimate to kill winds? Less than 30 minutes. Not bad. Listen to some music.
decade ago I never thought I would be 23 I'm the first spontaneous who must and woe is me But I guess that it comes with the territory On this landscape of never ending to now Give me a minute, I'll call you back. So 
I waited and waited and then I called back, well, we ain't got nothing. Uh, so they finally just let me have this one that was on their lot. They really screwed up, didn't they? Like I said, they screwed up, huh? If it pours rain, well, at least we can go somewhere and go to that sports store. Hopefully, don't. We're gonna talk about you know. South Carolina. Is you gonna get some food or? Yeah, I think we'll stop the wind just when we go in. Okay.
I'm again because we got to remember which one they renewed. Got some food on the way, huh? <laughs> To, we might have to go to probably that place we always went to get our pass. But we don't need to take petrol. No. We go to customer service, that's what we do. mess with the camera tomorrow by attempting going in the park today just We had a good time. <laughs> oh, it's been hot, people. <sighs> hot in misery. <laughs> Heading to Wendy's to get some ice cream. They told you, they told you, uh, when they tell you about this, him toy. Last week. Oh, okay. Yeah, see, everybody's got to work on the first, second, and third crew. They all work, everybody works overtime, everything, and it's, you work seven days, all seven days, and they brought about two, for the two weeks before him toy, you got to work every day, all seven days. Why? Get ready for him toy. You know we work five, right? Yeah. Five. Ooh, you don't have a little more money that way, for not you? Oh yeah. The bonus next month it, it ain't gonna be too big, but it's gonna be over three fifty. Better than nothing. Well, that's gonna go right at five. Yeah. What happened? Well, it, it was. They said that we didn't make. There's three three things that we got to make at least hundred percent on. The last one, we made 100% on one, 99 on one, 98 on the other, and we got almost $500. But this one we made, uh, it, it's not all final legit, but it, we made 100 on one, 90, 97 on one, and like 94 on another. But if we can bring the, the next two up in the next, by the end of the month, then we get a little bit more. But they said so right now it's, yeah, Right at $350. But if we bring the other two up, it might be another $50, $60. Yeah. 
seventy five dollars more. Get my first next my next bonus is my first paycheck in August. I say no August, September. Next yeah. Month. Falls, hurts themselves. Yeah. Uh, if a customer uh, writes in that they feel that our store is dirty or uh, they need to, you know, do a whole lot better. I mean, you're not, you're always going to have customers that feel like we well, do a whole lot better. Oh yeah. <laughs> but you know. Yep. You always going to have customers but, like I mean, that. It, it bases it ba a lot of it bases on how many customer falls. Uh, how many employees fall, hurt their sales, uh, you know, it comes out, you know, if a customer falls and they have to pay $500 out, then they fix it. But if somebody falls and sues us for $100,000, then we probably won't get a bonus. You know what I'm saying? So, oh. so it, it depends on, you know, it, we get a raise every four months, three raises a year. So. So every four months, uh, we can say, well, they can, it'll come up and say, okay, we had this, and you got 100% on this one, but, uh, but, but you, even if, even if you don't make 100% on the other two, you get close. See, if you made 100% on all three of them, it's guaranteed a little over $500. That's good. But if you, if one's like 100%, 100 and the other two are like 98, even though the other two are I ain't but four points off them. That four points might cost you a hundred dollars. Yeah. That's how it's based. Yeah. Even if you, uh, it's like I say, if you make a hundred percent, ninety-six, ninety-six. Uh, even though you, you missed it by eight points, that might cost you. Seventy-five hundred dollars from the bonus. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. You know. Okay, that was an interesting one. Breeze it, okay? Oh, we're, we're we're sold out of it. Then. We supposed to substitute tide with bleach uh, that don't have the Febreze in it. For yeah. The same price. Yeah. But you kind of pick it up. It's like, well, you get home like, well, wait a minute, this is ain't the, the brand I want. Yeah. Then you're gonna be dissatisfied. Basically, yeah. So yeah, uh, because you know me, like I told him, I said, you know, I think it is it's not a good idea. And they said, well, why do you take that? And I said, well, there are going to be too many mistakes. And, you know, a lot of people are not going to be satisfied. Our bonuses are based on customer complaints and satisfaction. So if they're not satisfied, then it's going to affect our bonuses. So a lot of, but it says, on the other hand, we, we make that extra $100,000. That's more money into the, your profit, which makes you uh, better for your get a, Get a bonus too. It's like, well, you know, it's, it's, you know, it, you know, if the customer's not satisfied, you might not get a good bonus, but you're making more money and profit, so, you know, it's, it's, it's got its good and bad points. Yeah. So it's, so you, uh, like I said, you already is, I Yeah, you, right now they're just only doing groceries, but around Thanksgiving, Christmas, you can order, you know, I want this and plus I want, uh, widescreen 50 inch TV that you got on sale. You know, we got it in store. You can order it online, you can pay for it. So it comes yeah. in Thanksgiving. 
you know, order electronics. Or, yeah, around around Christmas, they said Christmas time. You know, people, you know, they they do all their online shopping and everything. Then they can order the toys that they want. That's cool. Like that. That's cool. Never get out of car. Never get out of car. But me personally, I don't think it's a good idea. I mean, even though it's going to be an extra hundred thousand dollars a month more in profit, you're still going to have those customers a lot more a whole lot more customers that's not going to be satisfied with because well th this is what i wanted but you substituted this for it because you didn't have it in the store yeah so when a customer comes to the store and shops regular it's like okay they ain't got it but i'll get this right here they make the decision but see if you order they ordered online and then they turn around when we don't have it and we have to substitute something else for it yeah. Then when they get home, like, well, wait a minute, this ain't what I'm looking for. This ain't, you know. So you, you call back and say, well, I wanted the Tide with bleach that had uh, fabric softener in it, and you just gave me the Tide with bleach. Yeah. And so, you know, they're not satisfied. Nope. At the motel, people. Be enjoying the vlog. See if we got a free, be funny to go in here and they say, Well, we don't know what you're talking about. I don't blame him. He's the one said we got a free night. This epic killings vlog is coming to the end. Hope you liked it. Please hit the like button. Please give me a comment of new ideas. I'm up for anything. Please subscribe. Until next time, you take care. Bye now.